guess what? I did it again. Started the reaction cam, forgot to capture the game footage. So we've gone back a little ways, right to where we left off at the end of the last section there. Uh, fortunately, you didn't really miss anything in the way of scares or anything. You just, uh, you know, there was some, basically just me floating around in zero gravity trying to figure out what the hell I was doing and fighting that big monster and stuff. So, uh, really nothing more than you, what you would have expected. So, uh, yeah, I've, uh, gone back and we're going to do that again. Yeah. And I was talking about a bunch of stuff, too, so I guess I'll talk about it again. All right, so let's, um... Speaker's going for audio sync purposes once again. We'll head on up in the elevator here. Okay. So... Yeah, so I basically just attempted one more time and figured out what I need to do, so... Kill the big necromorph, align the solar panels, Bob, your uncle. Um, I figured out how to align them, like what exactly I was supposed to do as well. Yeah. So, we're just gonna head out here, and there's a little bit of dialogue, which we saw before. Entering zero gravity. Entering zero It looks like two of the mirrors are out of alignment. How's he doing? He's stopped hyperventilating, but I don't know how much longer he's gonna last. I knew he would just slow me down. If Strauss dies, so do my chances of destroying the marker. Keep him alive and get to that panel. Okay. So there's that big honking monster over there. I don't know how we missed that before. I mean, it's completely obvious. It's like covering that whole section. So, okay, let me just put the... Uh, Headphones back on here and we'll carry on. Just gonna take a quick health boost. And uh Okay. I'm just gonna head over this way. See if I hide behind here it, it can't see me and it can't shoot at me. That's why I wasn't shooting at me constantly. Um So yeah, sorry about that guys, it just it gets Sometimes you just get caught up in the game and forget to click all the start buttons, you know? So just make sure we're capturing, we're recording, we're good. Okay. Good, good, good. Okay. So I need to get into zero gravity so I can avoid these things. I'm just gonna move up a bit. And there we go, it's dead. It's that simple. Shoot the big pus bubbles, and it dies. Just fly over here. Ooh, I missed that before. Yeah, that's good to get. And what do we got over here? Oh, we got more goodies here, awesome. I don't know that I actually got these goodies before. Oh no, I did. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, so I've learned to find my way around a little bit more. But um, just because we're, well, we're in kind of a quiet section here, I wanted to talk a little bit about um, my first impressions videos just in general. Um, as some of you are probably aware, once in a while I do get some douchey comments on them. Um, people just don't seem to understand the, the extraordinarily simple concept of what exactly a first impressions video is. Let me just find which uh, panel we're supposed to go to here. Those two are active. Okay, hold on a second. Let me just get out here. Okay. Ah, there we go. I think? No. Oh, no, no. Yeah, we want these active ones. Basically, you want to move these like this one, uh, in alignment with that one. And then you want to move that one in alignment with that one, or no, that one in alignment with that one. There we go. Anyway, you'll, you'll see, you'll see. So anyway, they'll leave comments to say like, you suck, like, 
how could you make such a stupid mistake and blah 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 and it's like I tried to explain to them I said like well because it's my first time playing it's like yeah but that thing was totally obvious and like you should have known and blah 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 and they just talk a lot of crap and then some of them will go on to say uh um, what the hell sorry no hold on you basically have to align it to reflect off of the other one here there we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. All right, before. Ellie, one down. How's it looking on your end? I'm trying to roll back the cover now. Strauss, can you give me a hand with this? Oh, you'll hurt me. I'm not strong enough. I promise I'll protect you. Now, just get over here and give me a hand. Here. Something covering the collector panel. Oh my God. There's hun There's thousands of them. They're breaking apart! Ellie, get out of there! Oh my god, they're heading this way! Run, Strauss, run! Ellie, Ellie, come in! Ellie! Shit. Just read it on that one. Um, sorry, and then, yeah, and then they'll just go on and just talk a whole bunch of crap and tell a bunch of lies. They go, oh, well, you know, uh, so I'll say, like, yeah, I'm sure the first time you played, you played an absolutely perfect game. And they'll say, like, as a matter of fact, I did. It's like, no, you didn't. Don't fucking lie. Who are you trying to impress? Certainly nobody reading these comments is impressed, so get over yourself. Okay? It's not about who's better or who's, you know, poning more noobs and stuff like that. It's a, it's a game. It's about having fun. You know? I'm sorry that's a concept that's just too outrageous for you to understand, you know? Okay, so we aligned them, so basically just align the window with the, the panel there. It's a lot simpler than that. Isaac! Ellie! Ellie! You alright? We just made it to the crossover tube when the beam hit! Shit! Isaac! Those things are still heading towards the transport hub. They're wrecking everything in their path. Holy shit, they'll cut us off. Get to the hub! I'll meet you as soon as I can! <sighs> It's like they're just they're basically just flat out lying so yeah anyway one of the other things I wanted to say was some people ask me why don't you do more uh, full game walkthroughs like uh, like Dead Space and um, you know the, the truth of the matter is I didn't even mean to do a walkthrough of Dead Space originally as most of you know I only intended to do the first three parts and then those were so popular and there was so much demand for more that I did another three parts and then by that point, people were like, well, dude, why don't you just do the whole game? And I was like, fine, I'll do the whole game. And it took like six months. But uh, I should get some air, right? <laughs> and uh, this part I get totally it's up there somewhere. All right, well, let's get up there somewhere. Um... So in the end, I just ended up doing the whole game, but it, it actually wasn't my intention to do the whole game at the time. Um, what the hell? Where are you leading me? Oh, I know where. Yeah. Okay. So there's an oxygen thing, and then around, and uh, whoops.
government sector before they cut us off. You'll never make it down here in I'll time. I'll be there. I'll be there. Okay. Um. Stability detected in the array alignments. Emergency ejector systems initializing. Awesome. Okay. So, um, you know, I'd rather spend the time doing a wide variety of videos and doing a wide variety of content rather than spending days and weeks putting together a massive epic walkthrough. Now, basically I've made Dead Space the one exception because I love Dead Space, I love talking about Dead Space, I love playing Dead Space, I love reacting to me playing while I'm playing for you guys watching me playing and talking about it as we go and just having fun with it. Um, but I just want to say right now, basically, Dead Space is the one exception. So don't expect me to do big walkthroughs like this of everything, because it's just too time-consuming, and I'm not strictly a gaming channel. I mean, I do do games when I can, when YouTube isn't being a dick about them. But, um, you know, Dead Space is basically the one exception. Alright, so, I'll do, I'll do Dead Space stuff, that's about it. Alright, here we go. This is where I realized I had started the capture. Alright, here we go. Oh, jeez. I saw a bit of this in one of the trailers many moons ago.
Here we go. Isaac, I'll try to open the CEC door on your level. Thank you. Hold on. <coughs> oh, hello. <laughs> too late yeah just take your sweet time to open that door you know that's there's no rush or anything all right okay so we gotta find a nice uh, safe corner we can huddle up in Isaac, this way the train is this way I'm gonna run around and grab the ship while everything is blowing up I'll try to open the CEC door on your level. Hold on. Piece of shit, Lock. I'm giving it my codes, but it's not working. Focused on trying to live. <laughs> Such a shame I missed all the ammo and shit in there. Thank God I bought those extra helps. Ellie, you guys there? Did you make it? Shit, Isaac. Just shit. Hey, take it easy. It's okay. No, it's not. I was right here this morning with a crew of 30 people. We were overrun. And before I knew it, they transformed. 
I had to cut the arms and legs off my friends just to escape. I'm sure there's pieces of them still lying around here somewhere. Ellie, I know. I'm sorry. And here I am again. I've just walked one big fucking circle today. We'll get through this. Let's figure out how to meet up. Right. Um, there's a, a central hub in the main facility. Here are the coordinates. reloaded and everything and uh oh great we we have no ammo yeah we're fucked for ammo oh that's good yeah those uh those six shots will make a big difference thanks appreciate it See what we can do. <laughs> oh, there's a store over there. Oh, crap. Okay. There's a store. Let's go to the store. I, I like stores. 12,375 and no notes. Yeah. Um. Mm hmm. Fuck it, 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 fuck it. I need ammo. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Sorry. Going a little crazy because it's late again. Yep, I'm sure that room that I barely escaped from with my life was just full of ammo, but it was also full of an endless stream of necromorphs that wouldn't let me get anywhere near it, so, yeah. I'm actually curious, I'm gonna have to go back and try that area again at some point and see if in fact it is a limitless stream of necromorphs or not, you know. It'd be interesting to know. I know what you're thinking. You're not stomping the bodies. Oh shit, there's an audio log. Hang on, I gotta find the audio log. Where is it here? No. Database, here we go. Hey, we're on chapter 8 apparently. This is uh, Ellie's story. One. All teams, this is Caleb, xenogeologist from Langford Shift 1. There's something in the facility. We've lost three of our crew and can't contact Shift 4. Here comes the transport. Everybody get ready in case there's more. We're abandoning our shift and heading back up. Everyone else is ordered to do the same. Caleb, it's more of them. Shoot them, shoot them! <laughs> Isaac was looking bored. It's like, yeah, more of the same. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to take any chances. We might end up coming back to this area. I'm guessing we will because there's a locked door over there and it'll probably unlock later. And this room's probably going to have an infector in it. So, because there's a bunch of bodies and wherever there's bodies, there's infectors. So let's not make it easy. I figure, you know, I'd rather deal with one infector than an infector and a shit ton of necromorphs. Okay, I think we're good. Oh. There we go. Okay. Let's go. Another one. <laughs> hey, a power node! Yay! Jeez. Okay. Ah! I don't 
think I was looking in the right direction for whatever that was. <laughs> oh well. You got me with the sound. a whole bunch of stuff. Alright. Let's go. Ooh. I like holograms. They're pretty. Oh, crap on you. Yeah, whatever. We'll deal with all you guys after. Oh crap! Oh, we'll deal with you right now. Get out of me! Quite done. Vintage suit. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take my little dinky single shot of health. Alright. Any others? That was just crazy. That was absolute insanity. After all my precautionary body stomping, the infector shows up in a building in a room I haven't even been in yet and sends a bunch of slashes at me. That's just beautiful. And a bunch of fucking like super slashers that take 50 shots to take their leg off. I think of the super slashes, you gotta go for the arms. The legs are just too thick. Too meaty. Alright. Oh, this is great. I have two shots. Are you serious? No, I cannot. Oh, it's 12. Thank God. I was like, I can't have seriously gone through all that ammo already. <laughs> What the hell? Uh. Bodies floating in space. just retarded. I can't, you can't move when he's swatting them off, and meanwhile the fucking pregnant is crawling towards me, and yeah, that's just lovely. That's just lovely. How far along are we here? How far back did it put me?
crown. And this is why I upgraded the stasis. Because I knew if it's anything like the first Dead Space, the slashes get faster and stronger as the game progresses. So you really want to slow them down so you can at least have a chance, you know? Fucking crazy. Okay, so remember there's a big fat pregnant in the other room. Okay, so we gotta redo the node door. Good thing I checked. Yes, open. I got a power, see I got a power node. Actually, I think I got two power nodes. See, so that was totally worth spending a power node on because I got all that shit. Got the vintage suit schematic, which is great. Which I think is, um, I think it's a suit based on the first one. So. Remember, there's a big fat pregnant around the corner. Where did that other one come from? <sighs> All right. Let's um, try something a little different here. How many shots we got on the line gun? <laughs> Two, that's great. All right. We're going full on stasis and plasma cutter. Let's do it. from over here.
fucking shit. I thought I... Like, since when does a pregnant explode after you kill it? That has never happened before. Like, ever. Ever. Alright. Take 47. The stasis is definitely working out well. What is he taking his sweet time for? <laughs> Are you enjoying my nerd rage? Yes. Oh, it's that fucking thing, that's why. I be sucking any more? Yes, I could be sucking more. Let's see if we can suck some more. I'm all about maximum suckage. Okay, <laughs> I think we're good now. So basically there's no way to stop that infector in there other than to somehow get past the first guy, run through the door, get it, but then they're just gonna chase you through the vents. They'll get you, they'll get you. Rest assured, monsters are real. The boogeyman does live in your closet and you will die horribly if you go to sleep tonight. <laughs> I heard something in the vents. There's another one. There's another one creeping around here. Alright, grab everything, grab everything, grab everything, grab everything. Awesome, great, go. Let's go. Let's take some health. I'm gonna go fight this fucking pregnant and this fucking slasher. Fucking hate those things. Cause it's just you're incapacitated when he's swatting them off. You cannot 
even, like, crawl away or anything. You're just fucked. Get in here. Grab all the shit. section, I'll be very happy indeed. Actually, didn't even take that much damage there, which is pretty good. Like, comparatively. Hmm. Yeah, let's grab one of these. stick at the same time. What kind of lamer are you? God, I am so happy right now. I am so fucking happy. That just took forever. And there weren't even that many of them, really. They were just fast and vicious. And there's more crawling around in the vents. That's just peachy. Let's go back. I think there was a save point over here, wasn't there? A little bit earlier. Let's just save, shall we? If we can. Ah, uh, fuck. Store. Save station, yeah. Okay. Let's go back. It's right by the store. Okay. Uh, store. Yeah, there we are. We're gonna save right there. <laughs> oh, good lord, that was that was just insanity. And we're in chapter eight. There's apparently fifteen. We got a long way to go yet. There's like what? We're, we're barely halfway. There's like seven more chapters after this. What? Uh, actually, what do we got here? Uh, Vintage suit. What the hell? I thought I grabbed a bunch of power nodes. Why did I have zero? Vintage suit. Vintage suit grants unique functionality, uh, store discount, 20 inventory slots, and 15% armor. Your rig retains the highest upgrade of armor and in inventory. Wow! Nice. That's better than what I'm wearing. Well, if through some stroke of the gods we should have, uh, you know. Oh. Hey, what? Hold a second. Objective is that way, but we can go through here. Oh, this is the door we came in, right? Yeah, that's just the door we came in. Never mind. I was all excited. 
Thought we found a hidden spot, but no, apparently not. Wow, that that was just insane, man. Yeah, the uh Let me think here. What's uh You know, the controls, I mean, the controls are perfectly functional. And I understand, like, certain places where they limit the functionality to increase the tension and the danger and whatnot. But those fucking skin cap creatures, man, when they swarm you, and you're trying to swat them off you, you just cannot move until every single one of them has been swatted. Is there, there's not even anything over here. It was just a big, fat pregnant waiting for me. Ooh, an audio log. Just listen. Sorensen, do you read? It's Caleb, shift one. You guys better be right behind us. We're leaving a swarm of angry dead body parts behind us. Caleb, mm. come on! More are moving in ahead of us. I can see them! Everyone move it. Go, go, go! Nice. A little bit of chaos. Um. Yeah, I don't know what more I can say about that. <laughs> Pregnant suck. Be very, very strategic when you dismember them, otherwise they will explode all over you. Oh, that infector, th yeah, this is the room the infector was in, okay. So, we gotta keep an eye out for the infector. It's here somewhere. Oh, God! You saw, you saw every time I went in there, there was like a shit ton of power nodes. Where did they all go? What happened? I have no idea, like I could have sworn I used a node to go in, and then we went in, and you saw it. There was like, I got notifications that I picked up two power nodes in there. What the hell? So I go back to the, the store, and it doesn't show that they're there. Ramp off! Rip off. Where am I going? I'm just bitter now. <laughs> All right. See you later, creepy Nicole. Okay. Is it behind me? No. Oh, crap. I 
had some guy leave a comment on my uh, walkthrough of the Dead Space 2 demo, and he was some like PC gamer snob, and he was basically saying that the graphics in this suck, and it's gonna look way better on PC. And he like <laughs> he used all these terms that I swear he was just reading the specs off the back of his graphics card box and actually had no idea what he was talking about. Okay, let me explain the difference between games like this on console versus PC. On PC, you get a slight boost in the resolution. That's it. Otherwise, identical. Get over yourselves, PC gamer snobs. Seriously. Isaac, over here. The door is jammed. This must have been the last stand for was left down here. Can you get the door open on your end? No. The circuits are fried. They must have fused the panel trying to keep those things out. There's gotta be another way in. The only other way is through the processing plant. But it's not meant for human traffic. Step boy. I think I can stop it from here, though. All right. Do it. Me to borrow this. I want to take others to Ross. I'll be there soon. Okay. Sorry, I'm not saying. <clears throat> okay. I'm not saying that all PC gamers are automatically PC gamer snobs. Of course not. I, I game on PC myself. But um, I, I just hate these. I just hate fanboyishness, basically, of all things. Like. You know, when I did the Dead Space 2 multiplayer beta, people were, uh, you know, bitching and moaning that it was only available on PS3. It's like, well, PS3 was the development system, so that's what the beta was on, because that's what it was being developed on. Once it's perfected, they port it to the other systems, you know? I mean, the point of a beta is to play test, uh, you know, a, 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 a broken, unfinished, buggy version of the game to essentially try it out, tweak it, find errors, and help out the development team to make it as perfect a product as they can. So, you know, it just wouldn't be practical to have, like, half ports on all the different systems, you know, at the same time. It's, no, I mean, you'd put it on whatever the development system is. So if it was developed on PC, it would be on PC. It was on 360, it would be on 360. In this case, it was on PS3, so... Apparently the first one was developed on PS3 as well, so, you know. Keep the fanboy bullshit off my videos, that's all I'm saying. I got no patience for it. Schematic, detonator mines. Ah, that's the one uh, I keep picking up ammo for. Yeah, definitely gonna have to play this through another time. Oh, Jesus! Um. Ah. Whoa. <laughs> that got me. Step closer, you know. Alright. 
bit of health. Okay, good. Alright. System up ahead. Right. Oh. Manually shutting down the plant froze all the pressure valves in place. You'll need to find a way to force it open. Oh, I got these explosive things. Thing we can explode. tape. I got a little caught up in the game. We'll have to continue this on the next tape.